Hey guys, so for this video I just wanted to cover some of the camouflage I use for wildlife photography. Firstly guys, this video is non-sponsored and any of the gear I use is what I use personally. So I like to carry um, most of my camo in one of these bags. Um, this is a Breakup Infinity bag. Um, I actually got this from Kmart and it wasn't actually that expensive. I like it, it's got obviously it's camo and you can put it around your waist, which is pretty cool. So I usually put it around my waist and uh, put it to my back and so with the bag on top it just sits below, um, it's pretty handy. Oh this is a Mossy Oak Breakup Infinity, Mossy Oak. Okay I'll just cover the gloves first. So it's a pretty pretty lightweight. Um, they've got the real tree pattern on them. I think I believe it's a real tree four. Um, they kind of got like grippy grippy rubber actually on the on the palm, which is which is nice when you're trying to pick up a lens or it's cold or if it's wet, it won't just slip out of your hands. Um, yeah, also got more more grippy pattern there and it's a bit more thick texture which uh, is pretty handy but yeah these can uh, I actually got these off eBay I think it's about eight dollars Australian um, really recommend them they fit really well um, I believe they do different sizes as well but yeah when you've got the whole the whole gear on um, it really works pretty well for camouflage. So, yeah, but these are Remington or Ramington. Um, really good, really good brand. Really recommend them. So, these are quite lightweight, and even though they are lightweight, they still keep your hands pretty warm, especially from the if you get any breezes or anything, holding a lens and you get a bit of breeze in your fingers. Yeah, these, these do keep your hands pretty warm. Okay, so here is the top. This is the 3D camouflage. Um, it's also got a hood. Got a hood. And I find it's quite, it's very lightweight. You kind of just slip it over. So you've got a jacket, just slip it over. And it's really handy, which is pretty good. And it's because you've got the 3D, because it's 3D and you've got kind of like leaves coming off, it breaks up the silhouette. So if you stand, you're standing in a, in a woodland, um, you kind of blend a, a lot more in with the surroundings. So yeah, but this is really nice and it's, yeah, it's very thin, so it just slips over so you don't, just, you don't get really hot. At least I find anyway. Um, yeah, really good. Okay, so these are the pants or trousers. They're also the 3D camouflage, so for your silhouette. Again, lightweight. And kind of got a string, so it kind of fits really well. It's kind of like a one size fits all kind of kind of thing. So yeah. I'm not too sure about the brand on that one but I know it was about $20, $25 um, for the whole, just for those two pieces. Just, you can find those on eBay, really recommend it. Okay, so next we've got the, I've got like a face mask. So this, again, 3D camouflage, so it's gonna break up the silhouette. Um, it's also got, got like a mesh material it just goes over the face, so you can literally cover your whole face. And a breathing hole as well. It's pretty handy. Again, I don't know what the name of this brand is, <laughs> unfortunately. But um, you can find this on eBay and, eBay, and it's not all that expensive. So yeah, I literally just keep everything in there. Um, it's, it's pretty lightweight, so... And you can also sit on this if you wanted to sit on that. Um, if you chose to. But yeah, I carry, like to carry that just below my bag so you can tie it around your waist. It's really handy. 
Yeah, next I just wanted to cover some of the lens coats for for lenses. So I got this from Lens Coats website. Um, it's pretty. You don't find many of these around. Like you don't really. Um, they're kind of a bit more specialist. You have to kind of ask them to send you it because um, it's all custom made for each lens. Um, but this particular one is the Real Tree 4. Um, I really like that design, so there's a few to choose from. You can get like a snow, you can get a desert, um, or you can get like army camo as well. But I prefer just to go for this one. I believe it was around $180 for this one. Um, again, I got it for the got it for the Tamron as well. Around the same price. Yeah, but it's really effective. I mean, it protects your lens, especially if you're carrying around uh, like an F4 or any, anything bigger. Um, it protects it from the from uh, bashing. It's also pretty good for water, waterproofing as well, even though this is waterproofed. Um, yeah, really recommend it. I mean, even if you get different coloured different coloured ones. Um, really recommend it. It just breaks down the because Canon being Canon, they've made it white, so you'd us, you know, you get a bit shine up to anyone in the in the wilderness. So it's good to cover it up, and it looks pretty cool as well. So underneath it is sort of like a rubber, and it's really durable as well. So I could like. I don't think I'm gonna break that. So the, there was a process to ordering those. So I had to uh, head over to their website and actually email them personally. I mean, they are US based, so. So that's gonna be it for this video. Um, there's not a whole lot I can say about camouflage, but from personal experience, I find it really useful. Um, it allows me to get more, more closer to the animals. Um, kind of obviously break up my silhouette so I'm not kind of I can kind of hide a lot better so it does look a bit silly but um, it's definitely worth it I mean for me personally it allows me to get a lot more closer to the animals and um, it kind of breaks up my silhouette a lot more which uh, which is really nice so I just want to say thank you to everyone that subscribed at the moment um, so within a month I'm, I'm almost at 300 um, yeah, big thank you to everyone uh, for watching and comment, commenting on my previous videos. Um, really appreciate it. So, thank you guys. On this channel, um, I actually post kind of a lot more behind the scenes uh, stuff. So, if, if you go check out those videos, um, you'll see them at the end. Or if you head over to my playlist, you'll see them there. Again, thanks for watching guys. I um, hope you like this video. I'm looking to do a lot more kind of similar videos to this. Of, some of the stuff I use in the field. Um, yeah, hope you liked it guys, thank you.